It's a school of about 1,200 students. We've got a growing sixth form. Um, it's a very inclusive school. We're part of the Watford Consortium. We actually take a comprehensive intake. We take equal uh, percentages of students in each quartile. What makes the school special is that we have quite a large contingent of children with special educational needs and they are completely included in the curriculum. So our music lessons, for example, our curriculum music lessons are entirely inclusive. So we have special tables for wheelchair users so that we make sure that they're at the right height for playing keyboards and instruments and things. And we also have some equipment in the music department for special educational needs, such as electronic drum kits rather than acoustic drum kits. Music plays a huge part uh, in school life and in fact the arts in general play a massive role in, in terms of our kind of atmosphere and ethos that we have at the school. Personally for me, I'm passionate about the arts, I'm from a music background and music just is one of those subjects that brings a school alive. Nice and warmed up, here we go. Mm -hmm. I'm Francesca Marty, I'm a, I'm a Bushy Meeky, I'm in year eight. And my favourite subject is pe uh, singing lessons. <laughs> you work very hard, don't you? Yeah. Yeah, yeah you do. Because you're the best teacher in our world. I'll take that, thank you very much. <laughs> do you remember our funny vowel sounds that we started? They are just a delight to teach. We learn the songs in exactly the same way as I teach the songs to anybody else. And if they need additional resources like bigger words and things like that, I always make sure we do that. Have a chat, because quite often people want to have a chat before they even open their mouths to sing. Um, and I think that's a very important part of teaching is that they have a one-to-one -one session with me. They can offload and say whatever they like because I'm not a proper teacher. You know, I'm not a, not a teacher teacher. I'm just in here with them and they can sing and say whatever they like, um, within reason, obviously. <laughs> Bushy Meads as a school, with its inclusion, is incredible. The, the kids that they've got here, and some, some schools I teach at don't have that, um, and they're given every opportunity to take part in as much as they want, just the same as any other child, which is brilliant. The one way in which the music mentoring programme has benefited our students is that they now feel like they're musicians and they belong to that club, which I think is a huge boost. If you're a musician yourself, you'll know how special that feels. They've kind of clubbed together as, as the musicians in, in bass, which is our uh, area for special educational needs children to sort of hang out at lunch times and break times. And so there's a growing sort of social club really that, that I think wouldn't have happened without this music based mentoring programme. Report data can fluctuate with all children, but the children that we've got on this music mentoring programme, consistently their attitude to learning is rising, particularly in subjects like maths and English and science. But really across the board, they're doing really well with how engaged they are with school. And I think that really does have to do with the music mentoring programme and how confident they feel. It's been really wonderful to see, you know, students in wheelchairs who you thought, you know, might find it quite difficult to learn the drums, really getting a benefit out of drum lessons. Students that struggle with their kind of speech impediments, actually being able to sing and write songs and then perform them on stage. So it's, it's been really wonderful to see that. So we're practising uh, our performance piece, or the first part anyway, whatever becomes our performance piece, uh, for a concert that's in a few weeks. 
Um, so let's have a little run through and see how we get on. I think one of the key things we've seen is that whilst the music lessons are going on and they've tended to be one-to-one -one because of the, the, the needs of the students involved, there clearly is a lot of sort of mentoring, softer mentoring going on during the music lesson and I, th I think the key things that we've seen is we've just noticed attitude to learning levels have risen and confidence of students has really grown and also I think they've really felt very much part of the school, they've really felt kind of they've got a role within the wider community of the school and I think it came to a head at the end of year one of the project when a concert was laid on for the students that uh, had been part of the project and you know we saw students on stage who you never would have dreamt standing up on stage and singing a solo in front of a hundred students and really getting an enormous benefit from that. I'm performing the impossible dream and I'm really happy about it. I feel like I've got so much better in the year and my music lessons are going fabulously well. To read the reachable star! So proud I feel so proud she's just been amazing she they work they all work so hard for this and the confidence that it just shows I feel that the music has really benefited Francesca because even she had an operation last week and we were singing in the anesthetic room because she was nervous it's definitely helped it helps all around she's become more confident through doing this it's just been amazing for her Jack's music lessons have, have been a huge benefit to his learning. Not only does it improve his concentration, his motivation, he is so happy and very passionate about coming to the drum lessons every week. The sense of achievement, you can see it in his face, he's really, really good. We're really proud of him. We've really seen the benefits here at Bushy Mead School of music-based mentoring, really supporting those with special educational needs or in vulnerable circumstances. The impact of music across the school is growing as our department grows and the value of music is being seen more and more by teachers and TAs and parents and all stakeholders as children are participating more in music and reaping the benefits of being involved. <laughs>